Hey, what's up everybody and welcome back. This is Don and you are watching VR Gamer Dude and uh, today um, I'm going to jump back in uh, to the Y'all VR and the Pimax 8KX and start the actual campaign for Warfighters, uh, Warplanes, WW1 Fighters. I, I had a ton of fun streaming this last night uh, and man it is working so freaking good with the uh, space monkey telemetry provider uh, plug-in and um, sim racing studio so i did get a couple of questions about how to set all that up so um, i'm gonna try to do that right here on the stream i hope it doesn't break everything um, but uh, yeah let's go so, all right, here we go. Um, we've got, first of all, um, we've got the Pimax software here. We've got all that set up. I am running now in 90 hertz mode with the 8KX at 100% in Steam VR. It is looking gorgeous. It is, it is butter smooth now, just like any of my other uh, headsets. You definitely can tell a difference between the old 75 hertz and the new 90 hertz. Um, okay, so in order to get everything set up, if you have a Yaw VR, um, you are going to need a couple of different things. You're going to need Sim Racing Studio. Uh, highly, highly recommend this software if you are using a motion simulator, especially a Yaw VR. Uh, it, it gives a ton more game compatibility and it uh, it automatically hooks the games, so you don't have to like alt tab out and start them and everything. But there are still a couple of games that don't work uh, by providing telemetry and they require some hacks to get it working and in order to get those working we are now using this awesome plugin by fart games yeah you heard it fart games um, that uh, basically uh, hooks into some of the other games that a lot of these softwares don't natively support and obviously one of them is warplanes ww1 here so um, pretty simple. You, you start the game, uh, you start SRS, you start Space Monkey, you click Warplanes, you initialize the uh, telemetry, and boom, it's going to hook in, hopefully. Because, yep, there we go. Plug in successfully injected. And now we should be able to switch back to our game and we see Space Monkey injected and we are ready to play. So without further ado, I'm going to jump out of all this blah, 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 and uh, we'll go ahead and get started. So um, I will try to check chat throughout, uh, mostly on the YouTube side. I, I am multi-streaming again today using uh, this new plugin I found, this multiple output plugin for OBS. Um, it, it is uh, working great, so I'm going to start multi-streaming to both with my Facebook page and my YouTube page, but obviously for the best quality, you want to be watching this on YouTube. So, and I prefer that you watch it there. Uh, so anyway, that is where I will be checking chat. All right, let's go. Pull that up and hey, Deadly B. All right, we're going to get started here. I'm Getting a Lenovo Legion Y 720. Uh, haven't heard of that one, but uh, glad you're excited for it. All right, let's go. All right, here we go. All right, we're in the game. Hopefully everything is working good. Um, let's see. We've got Mahotas. Let's make sure we got... All right. I think my Hotas always wants to give me a little trouble here at first, so hold on. Let me get this nailed down here real quick, guys. Alright, say Tech X52. Make sure everything is good. So normally I should just get a little dot here. Ah, screw it. We'll just start it like we did last night. Alright. Let's go. Oh, okay. Um, this is new. Um, I guess it's because I actually played a little bit last night, um, so I had not actually seen this. So now I can actually choose some missions. Um, so I just wanted to start from the beginning. So I don't know how to do that. So, oh, multiplayer. Ooh, maybe we should do that instead. I don't know. Um, 
Let's see, field marshal, health and urgent. Sure, whatever. We'll do it. Ooh, a nighttime mission. Still don't know why my Hotas isn't working. There we go. Nice start. Oh yeah. Let's get some light. I'm gonna have to see what's going on with my Hotas again. That's all right, though. He can fly this one pretty good with the motion controls. God, this looks good. All right, protect the town AA defenses, and we do have to destroy some fighters and bombers here. You know, I'm going as fast as I can. Oh, they're shooting. They got tail gunners. Okay. Got you. Nice. Oh, wow, the flak. This is cool. Oh man, I'm loving all the searchlights and the freaking AA going on here. I gotta catch these guys though. Need some more speed. The air raid sirens going off in the distance. This is nuts. I got you. I got you now. Lead the target. Lead the target. There we go. Take out your bombers first. That's what I'm talking about. Enemy bombers in sight. Nice. Oh, this game just makes you feel like a badass. Woohoo! 
God, get those bombers. Command, focus on the target. Under yeah. heavy fire. I'm working on it. it ain't easy without my Hotas, yo. Don't know why that's not working. We're gonna figure that out. Next battle, though. Reload, reload. Trying to creep up on me. I see how you are. The hull is going down. Yeah, he is. I have a visual on enemy fighters. Okay, I'm halfway there. Halfway there. It's closer. The bomber, the fighters. Bomber, the fighters. It's getting a little harder to control. Ha <laughs> ha! Nice. Objective completed. One step closer to victory. Damn straight we are. I'm on the edge of stalling. those fighters. There they are. Four more. Alright. I'm going to take a... Uh, yeah, four of eight. Two more, two more, two more. Man, being able to see so clear in the uh, 8KX really makes a difference in games like this. Those planes aren't just blurry little pixels off in the distance. Ha <laughs> ha! Oh, you didn't like that, did you? Where's your buddy? Where's your buddy? Here we go. Here we go. Last one. For the win! <laughs> Woohoo! Victory! Alright. Locate the airfield. Position. Okay, this is what I couldn't do last night, so I'm assuming this is the airfield. But man, nothing down there looks like a damn runway. Everything's so short. Position the plane on the axis of the runway. Reduce speed. Lower the plane gently. If anything goes wrong, fly off and try again.
That is a short runway if that's the airfield. But I'm, I'm assuming going too it is. Slow. It's going to stall. Okay. I'm stalling. Oh, you're not stalling. Shut up. We're landing this plane. I'm stalling. And I'm back. <laughs> I did it. Woo. All right, so this was awesome. Okay, very, very cool. Loved that. Loved the night mission. I mean, man, I thought, you know, night, it's going to look kind of murky. It's going to look kind of messed up, but no way. It actually looked great. Um, like, you know, I'm just going to tout it again. The, the, the Pimax 8KX, guys. I know, I know. I know you get sick of hearing me talk about it, but it, it is a damn good headset. I, I don't care what anyone says. I mean, it is insane how good this headset is when it comes to just visual clarity and obviously that field of view and now we've got the 90 hertz working in it uh even on a 2070 super that blew me away because i did not think that the 90 hertz mode was supposed to work on anything other than Pime, uh, the uh the rtx 30 series cards which a i can't afford because scalpers and um, b i can't uh you know i can't find uh, because scalpers. <clears throat> so, all right, looks like I can buy another plane here. So, all right, buy. amazing forward visibility, lots of flares, machine gun lacks, and unlocking mechanism. Okay, so I can afford either one of these three. Excellent fast plane, perfect for the role of bomber hunter. I think we're going to go with the DH-5 here. Go ahead and purchase that. Oh, looks like we can. Ooh, we can color it and everything. Nah, I guess I won't mess with all that on a stream. So, all right, real quick, since we're between missions, I am gonna flip over real quick and see if anybody is actually watching. Yeah, we got a few people watching today. So, thank you for coming by the stream to uh, check out a little Warplanes WW1 fighters and uh, what I'm doing today. So, uh, I very much appreciate it. And uh, we are also streaming over here on Facebook today. Uh, looks like we got a couple people watching on Facebook today as well. So, thank you uh, to the Facebook audience audience for showing up. Um, you know, if you guys have any questions about anything that I'm doing here, uh, any questions about the, uh, the the Pimax, any questions about the Yaw, any questions about the game, please feel free to throw them in chat. Uh, you know, in between missions here, I will uh, give that a look. So, all right, let's go back to the game here because I want to figure out why my HOTAS isn't working because I'm really really missing that oh whoa oh i didn't know you could move around <laughs> oh cool uh so you can actually like walk around a little bit um that was that's kind of messing with my head um okay definitely i don't know if you're supposed to do that but oh very cool okay very cool like that um Um, I don't want to reset the save controls. There we go. Okay, so uh, you guys can all see this. I, I have the assigned controller as the Satec X52. And, but, oh, wait, okay, there we go. Now we're working. There we go. All right, so now let's pick another mission here. Let's see, Turkey or Italy? Or Russia. Let's go Italy. Go say hey to my friend Tyriel, who just moved back to Italy. Whoa. Whoa, okay, hold on. Now we're not facing the right way here. Seems like when I use my Hotas, sometimes I lose some... There we go. 
that hand handy because I might need that for some flares. Let's go. All right, here we go. Now we're feeling better. Ah, uh, I love it. I do too. I really do. This is slowly but surely becoming my favorite game to play right now. Now, I don't know why it does that. Like, once I get in the air, it, like, changes up everything. All right, so destroy boats. Ooh, going after boats. Where are you, little boats? Looks like we got some fighters in the air as well. So I say let's take these guys out first. Skippy is. Enemy fighters approaching. Watch your six. All right, where are these boats? Ah, took your tail off, son. I'm just gonna strafe you from the side. I've seen no boats. Ooh, damn, they got my tail. Alright, let's go to the deck. Come on. Chase me. There's my boats. Last night I grabbed a bomb down in here. I wonder where I get those. Can I fly under the bridge? I'm gonna try. Woohoo! That's a mighty powerful flare gun. I'm stalling. No, you're not. Shut up. Miss. Target eliminated. No, pull up, pull up, pull up. Woo hoo! Oh, oh no, man. That was not cool. All right, let's go again. That was great. All right, let's go. Airborne, let's get some altitude. Here we go. Ooh.
Mindful of those fighters, Don. Oh, no, 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 no. Can't pull that out. Ah, can't pull it out. All right. So I got to work on my ground targeting here. That is definitely not a strong suit right now. Finally, I was like, I only taxied for like a second. All right. Okay, here we go. All right. Let's get some of those fighters off my back again. Take out your boots. Man, this is awesome. I, I, I said this last night. I'm, you guys can't see it on the stream, but I got a fan blowing on me right now. And it is totally selling it. I would really like to get the smart plug attachment that you can use with Sim Racing Studio to actually have a fan that turns on and off as I fly and increases speed. That would just be nuts. Oh man, I almost felt like I needed to duck that wing. Stay on him, stay on him, stay on him. Maybe I should actually go after the boats. Because I don't think that the fighters are going to stop. I think they're a constant annoyance here. Where are the boats? Oh, 
Oh. There's a bomb. Sweet, I get to chuck bombs, man. Pull it up, pull it up, pull it up. Woo! Alright. My flare gun. Missed him. I got you. Boat destroyed. That was the last one. Good job. Hoo hoo hoo. Nice. All right. So there we go. We got to land again. It's all right. Because now I know I'm not looking for an airstrip. I just got to land over here. So that works. God, it always feels like I'm coming in so fast. Oh, what the? Oh, no way. No way. Okay, well, at least it still gave it to me. Uh, because, man, that was going to, like, really tick me off. So, all right, I'm going to jump over and check chat here. Um, I'm also going to check uh, to see if I'm starting to get a little throttling in the yaw here. Uh, it is super, super freaking hot in my studio, as it was last night. Um, I thought you guys might be able to hear all the fans and the air conditioner behind me and all that last night, but I was pleasantly surprised with the old mod mic wireless here. God, it cuts out a lot of that, a lot of that background chatter and noise. So, um, all right, let's see here. Looks like uh, nobody's really chatting today. Um, we've got a few people still watching on Facebook. So, um, in order to check the uh, throttling um, for people who don't own a yaw, it is actually kind of cool. Uh, you do have a, um, a phone app here that you can um, actually see your yaw VR um, in. And let's see here. Yes, there we go. Yeah, I don't know if you guys can see that on camera, but it is actually throttling my yaw. Um, it, basically, what it does is there's uh, some sensors on the motors here that, that will kind of throttle them down a little bit. So you may be getting 
Um, you may be getting, um, like you guys are seeing, it may not be 100% matching with the motion. Um, I don't see that. I don't feel that in the headset, but it, it definitely does slow it down to save the motors, um, and it starts to become a little bit noticeable. So I guess with that, uh, maybe it is time to take a little break. Um, I do really appreciate everybody coming out and watching today and I guess about 40 minutes that's about how long we streamed last night um, under perfect conditions you know if I got the studio um, uh, if I got the studio really really um, cold uh, I can I can definitely play for a little bit longer in the yaw but today in Missouri it is almost 100 degrees out there and there's no central AC in my studio it's all a little window unit so it definitely makes the yaw get uh, a little <laughs> a little warm so I think we're gonna go ahead and cap it here uh, CNT C VR gamer sis says hi hey what's going on VR gamer sis uh, and uh, I want to thank once again, like I said, everyone for coming out. I want to thank Sim Racing Studio. I want to thank Fart Games for giving us Space Monkey plugin. Man, this is making my day being able to play games like this. Obviously, I want to thank y'all. Um, for their amazing motion simulator. I know you guys already are well inundated by it, but man, pre-orders for the Yaw 2 are open. They have 1,200 to get through from the Kickstarter, so it's not going to be anytime soon, but uh, we are hoping to get one here in the studio eventually to play with. Uh, they are actually going to be demoing the Yaw 2 here in the U.S. Um, uh, very shortly. I think they're, they're planning some sort of a launch event in September, and uh, I cannot wait. But for me, today, guys, that's going to do it. I am going to jump out, let you guys get back on with your Sunday afternoon. But thank you for coming by. And if this was your first time and you liked what you saw, you know what to do. Smash subscribe, ring the bell. That way you guys help me get to 10,000 subscribers. We are so close, man. We need like 700 more subscribers here on the channel to hit the magical 10K. And I don't know. That's always been my goal ever since I started this channel is just to see uh, enough people to fill a stadium watching me. So anyway, all right. I love you guys. I will see you very soon with another live stream or video right here on the channel. Peace.